in a very different way, our first entertainment winner is in, it's kind of related to health and health care. And I'm referring, of course, to Dr. Katz, professional therapist. <laughs> this animated program, which has probably not got the seal of endorsement from the American Psychological Association, chronicles the life of a psychiatrist, his clients, and his ever-present number one son. But I just want you to be relaxed, you know, and to be able to enjoy the, the visit. Because this is a wonderful opportunity for you and Roz to catch up, you know. Who's you, Roz? Your mother. <laughs> All right. <laughs> See what I mean? Right, right. For instance, you could exchange names. Yeah, that'd be nice. Her and, name is Roz? Yeah. Man, I just hope we don't hug and cry all night. No, that's not going to happen. Good. Plus, there's nothing to be nervous about, you know? Mm. I well, mean, after all, she's, she's the fruit of your loins, so... You're the fruit of my loins. You... <laughs> no. Mom is the fruit of your loins. No. Mom took an interest in my loins. We made fruit. You... <laughs> oh, you mean the fruit is the... The child is the fruit. That's right. <laughs> You you said it, not me. I'm not, <laughs> wow. So I am the fruit of your loins. Yeah, but do you want a t-shirt that says that? <laughs> With an arrow? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here to accept in real life, but we hope with animation, our creative producer Jonathan Katz and executive producer Tom Snyder. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. It's, uh, it's so hard to say in, it's a, in 20 minutes, really, what, a, what needs to be said. But uh, this first song... No, I, I actually... I'm a little embarrassed because a lot, of the, a lot of the people here today who I know very well have never seen me be sincere, but I'm going to do that. So first I want to thank H. John Benjamin, who plays my son, who is the son I never had. Laura Silverman for being the receptionist that I do have. <laughs> Willa Bow for drinking with me all these years. Julianne Shapiro for letting us run up a tab. And mostly I wanted to thank Tom Snyder who's standing right next to me. A little awkward. <laughs> for creating the universe in which Dr. Katz can exist. Lauren Bouchard for constantly reminding me where Jonathan Katz ends and Dr. Katz begins. Bill Bradis for reinventing Dr. Katz on a regular basis, and Annette Kate, who is the artist who did the original artwork for creating with simple line drawings a character, I'm gonna try not to cry now, who appears to feel not just like Dr. Katz might, but like Jonathan Katz does. Also, my thanks to Comedy Central, Bonnie Burns, Rick Abrams, Nancy Sapler. I shouldn't gloss over Comedy Central like that. They, they have been so extraordinarily supportive. Uh, John Fisher, Nancy Geller, for their enormous support to all these, uh, and, and to all the troubled people I've treated over the years. <laughs> in, in particular, Dom Irero, who has, even though it's a cartoon, it's, I'm not really a therapist, he still crosses the boundaries of therapy. Um, to uh, Nikki Hebert, Melissa Barden, and Jen Snyder for dealing with all these troubled people I've seen over the years. And to my wife, Susan, who also reminds me where Dr. Katz ends and Jonathan Katz begins. In fact, she can point to the exact spot. <laughs> also, our very special thanks to Marianne Minster from, from Comedy Central for pointing us out to the Peabody Committee, the Peabody Committee for noticing us. Thank you. Uh, one of the things that I think that the team that Jonathan just mentioned has done is created a, a uh, um, persistently art, artistically uh, comedic and, but never mean-spirited world. And in fact, if you know Jonathan Katz, that is a perfect description of him too as a person. <laughs>